Warrant? No problem. Do police need a warrant to seize your property? Our investigator Brian Moss says a recent case in Adams County shows they don't. You need a warrant for the date and the time that happened and you're not taking all of our videos. The seizure was caught on cell phone so video. You Here, I'm not going to let him take it. Do you want to get arrested? Do you answer me yes Don't or no? Don't scare me. It was earlier this month at the Ugly Dog Saloon in Adams County, a tense showdown between bar manager Lynette Smith and sheriff's detectives. And you're not allowed to come back here and okay. do this. But they did, seizing the restaurant's DVR recorders without a warrant. This all started inside the bar the night of September 5th, when some patrons got into an argument. Employees of the bar became involved and it all spilled out outside and got physical, eventually turning into an assault investigation. A full day and a half after the incident, Adams County investigators descended on the bar, demanding access to the DVRs so they could see footage of the altercation from surveillance cameras. But the restaurant owner, Scott Reich, who is also a lawyer, was on the East Coast and says he and bar employees did not have immediate access to the codes necessary to access the DVRs. You were willing to turn over the DVRs or the material on them, the content? Absolutely. If we had, if I'd had the code, I would have given it to the officer at that time. He told investigators someone could get the DVR codes the next morning from his office. We will cooperate. We have no reason not to cooperate. You know, if this happened outside the bar, let's get to the truth. But investigators wouldn't wait. They unplugged the machines and hauled them away without a warrant. On tape, a detective explained the urgency. Why couldn't you wait for the warrant till tomorrow morning? Yeah, because overnight, all kinds of data could be erased off of this thing. It's what's called exigent circumstances. If police believe there's an imminent threat, evidence might be destroyed, they can seize property with no warrant. The Adams County Sheriff declined to say more, citing an ongoing criminal case. I don't see that emergency situation. But David yeah, Miller, a defense attorney and former case. prosecutor, yeah. says deputies could have obtained a warrant in about an hour. There's no reason for them not to just have one deputy stand there and preserve the area while they go to the on-call judge to get a warrant. There's no reason not to get a warrant. You're taking it illegally. I hope you like that you're getting sued. This is the most egregious uh, illegal seizure that I've ever seen. And the beautiful thing is, it's all on videotape. I'm Brian Moss, covering Colorado first.